Egyptians used math for measuring time, straight lines, level of Nile flooding, calculating areas of land, counting money, working out taxes, and cooking. The Egyptians, like the Greeks, had no concept of zero. They used addition, subtraction, some division, and multiplication. However, they only divided and multiplied by two. Go. The Akam wooden tablet was what they used for math. The first half of the tablet details five divisions of Hecate, which is an ancient Egyptian volume unit. It is used to measure grain, bread, and beer. The Rhind Mathematical Papyrus was their mathematical or mathematic textbook. From this, they were able to calculate portions of pyramids. Problem number 56 in the papyrus gives an equation to find the angle of the slope of a pyramid's face, which is cotangent. The papyrus also calculated pi as 3.1605, a margin of error less than 1%. They found such accurate readings from these two possibilities. The first one being African crafts demonstrating snake curves and sets of equidistant concentric circles. And the second being board games resembling mancula found in the mortuary temple of Seti. There was one ancient person who got the Egyptian calendar closest to the true year, through math skills. It was also used with fantastic results for building tombs, pyramids, and other architectural marvels. Pythagoras studied temples for 22 years and came up with the Pythagorean theorem to help build temples. The Egyptians took 20 years to build, complete the Great Pyramid to Khufu. It took 10 minutes to fit seven huge blocks into place. They used triangular plumb bobs to measure if each stone was level. They used two equal lengths of wood attached to a string, plus a third piece, to make sure the stone was flat. They would hold the string tight, then run the third, the third piece of wood under the string. If it hit the string, they knew it had a high spot, and they would sand it down. Trig was developed the earliest in the Nile Valley. The trig map is confirmed by an architectural drawing older than Ryan Papyrus that shows Nile Nilotic engineers had learned to find the area under a curve. They used roots and square roots to plot an arc by using offsets that were measured at regular intervals from a baseline and could find areas to help build the pyramids. Egyptians used fractions to complete the volume of boxes, pyramids, and calculate to calculate surface area of rectangles, triangles, circles, and spheres.